Hello everyone, I am back, and I have some good news. I put my name on a list for both a, a Z06 C8 Corvette and an E-Ray C8 Corvette, and I just got a call this morning that my allocation for the E-Ray should be available next week. So now I need to go online, figure out what options and order I want, and submit that to the sales guy and next week they should be able to put in my order for it. It's going to be several months before the car actually shows up uh, and in the meantime I've got to figure out a couple of things. One, how am I going to pay for another Corvette since I am pretty much tapped out and the second thing, what body am I going to put on it and yes I am going to rebody the E-Ray. I think it's going to be awesome to have a mid-engine car all-wheel drive uh, car that is a Corvette underneath with a different body on. I am probably going to do my Art Deco body. Those of you that have been following me for a while know that was my original intent and somehow in the years since I've gotten distracted and built other things instead. So now I would like to go back to doing my uh, original concept or one of my original concepts. So, so far I've had several concepts made digitally and some of them 3D printed and it's gotten down to this looks like the top contender. So I had this one done a while back and um, it's more to my original design. Uh, this one did 3D print. Unfortunately, it doesn't exactly fit a C8 chassis. Uh, one of the issues is this vent right back here goes too far back. It needs to go up to here. Uh, the radiator actually sits in front of this. So if I were to do it like this, the radiator would be exposed. I don't think the tail end is tall enough to cover up the back of the C8, so that would have to be fixed. Um, I would like to do at some point a coupe just so that I could do a split window on one of the cars, but I am a convertible fan, especially a hard top convertible, so I will probably order this one as a convertible as well. Uh, that spoiler may need to be on there to cover up the tail section of the C8, or I may actually end up cutting it uh, off. I was trying to avoid that previously. I may change my mind. Anyway, this is the design that has risen to the top. There are several others, but I'm thinking this is the one I'm going to have done. The options are I am getting a five axis mill. Uh, if I can get it working without it being the huge frustration that the uh, Modix 3D printer was, uh, I will likely carve this body or the new version of this body um, out of foam and then have a, a mold made from the foam and then a body made from the mold. If that doesn't pan out, uh, I also have someone that said that they could do the slats, the uh, lattice work. Uh, so I'll get a 3D model made of this with the correct proportions done to it and then uh, have the patterns made for the uh, wooden lattice work, have the lattice work made uh, and then I guess foam in between the lattice and then same thing have molds made and then a body made from the molds. So anyway, um, I've got a couple of months to get all this figured out and going, but that looks like the story right now. So anyway, just want to pass the information along and go ahead and like, subscribe, hit the alert, hit the thanks if you want to donate. And if you don't like what I'm doing, you don't know Jack. Bye.